Hey guys, I am back with a haul from the fabric store. Again, thank you to everybody for the 500, or, yeah, the 500 subscribers. Um, I love seeing all your comments on there and um, good luck to the one lucky winner. <laughs> uh, I just got back from here and uh, yes, it's not set up all pretty like it normally is because it was a mess. Um, I have some, well, this is kind of what I'm not keeping. Uh, this cake tray, I don't have any of the other pieces for it, so I won't be keeping that. And you can see uh, they put glitter glue on like everything, or they tried to, but then when they, this was one of the boxes out of there as well that I emptied out. Um, but when they threw it in the dumpster, uh, most of the stuff fell out, so it didn't really get the glue on it. Thank God. I did not record because uh, the FedEx truck was there making a delivery when I got there. So I waited and I didn't wait too long after they went back in before I checked in this dumpster and I really wasn't expecting to see anything because I haven't found anything at this dumpster in quite some time. So um, I will get right into it and show you everything that I found. Uh, first thing is this tree. I think this might, might go on top of it. And it has this little wood stump base and you can see it's broken and the other piece was in actually a different box than what the tree was in. So, but I think this, uh, you can see the glue on there, but I think it goes on top like that. So I'll figure it out. And I found these bulbs. There was actually one more, but on my way to the truck, one fell out and shattered. I thought they were plastic, but they're actually like a really thin glass. So those are really cool to craft with at this time of year. And there were two of these little uh, reindeer, I guess is what they are. And they're in the plastic, so they're fine. The glitter is on the package. And this was in there. It makes some sound, so I'm not sure if maybe part of it's broken, but I don't see anything wrong with it other than it rattles. So I'm thinking maybe the bottom is busted. But it's uh, that right there, Santa riding a unicorn. <laughs> so that's really, really cute. Oh, it is. Look at it right there. I don't know if you can see that hairline crack right there but I'm gonna try to repair that and see if one of my niece want, my nieces wants to paint it and there are two of these in there this one just has like one little tip of his reindeer broken off he's got a little glue but that just peels right off because these are ceramic but isn't that so cute oh my gosh I've been wanting one of these I don't know if they're Boston Terriers or French Bulldogs but I have been dying to get a French Bulldog for I don't know, a couple years now, my son's friend has one, and I keep telling him I'm going to steal her and take her home. And then I found another one. This one has a little more glue on him. I'll get it off, but he's missing a bigger chunk of his antler, but he's still just cute. Cute, cute, cute. Love him. And then this little uh, floral pick was in there. The bottom busted off, but it was in there, so I will glue it back. And this is actually a candle stick holder. And the other piece is right here, and it stands up like that and holds your candlestick. Now, it does have a piece broken there, but I can put that to the back, which I will anyway because the piece is broken off there. And this little bear, I guess he's an ornament, was in there. I think he's missing part of his butt or something. I don't know. I'm not exactly sure what's wrong with him, but he's cute, and he can be used. And then this is a fabric marker. So I will be using that for sure. Uh, I did not find the other piece of these, sadly. And this I am going to see if my sister wants. Now you can see it was supposed to have something across the front. I don't know what it was, but it's really cute just the way it is. I can just touch this little paint up. And it is a pug dog. My sister has had a pug for many, many years and just recently had to put him down. He... Uh, lost function in his back legs so she was very sad about it and so I'm not sure how she will take getting a pug thing or not but I'll ask her if she wants it and there was this ribbon and like I said they threw the boxes in and they like spilled out so I kind of had to like climb up on the dumpster and grab everything one by one put it back in the box but I used the same box and it was pretty nice to load it in the box and carry it to my truck and uh, there was this ornament in there I guess he was missing the top of his hat there, or she, because it's a baby's first. I'm going to see if I can get that glitter off and give it to my sister for her little girl coming along. She just had her ultrasound today. Everything looked good. 
And she was sucking her thumb, I said, just like her mom. My sister used to be a thumb sucker as a kid. <laughs> so I'm thankful for that. It is her rainbow baby. And there was all of these uh, floral pieces on picks, this like eucalyptus, some Christmas ones. That one's really cute. I'll use that one. Um, but I will add them to my collection of flowers. And there was this little bouquet. It is missing a few flowers, but... It's still a pretty bouquet. And these Halloween eyeball bouncy balls out of season. So they tossed them. And this owl was in there. He's missing an eyeball, but I can get another eye. And he's got a little bit of glitter on him, but he's still just super cute. Look at his little fluffy hair. So he's cute. And then this was in there, but it doesn't have the top pan here. So I'm not sure if you guys know anything about these, if I can just use something different. Uh, my sister uh, likes to make chocolate-covered strawberries, so I was going to give this to her. They cut the cord, of course, so I'll have to repair the cord. But uh, let me know if I can use something different for the top. I don't know if I can just use a small pan or something. I'm not sure. And there was a hot light replacement bulb in there. And it looks fine. I pulled it out. It looked fine. I'm not sure if it works or not. And then this was in there. You guys can see it says return broken. And it is this keepsake plate kit. You paint the plate and give it away for like Christmas or whatever. It says decorate me for the perfect gift. And it says we're broken. I just pulled it out of the box and it's perfectly fine. Not even a chip scratch anything on it. It has the paint, the paintbrush, and the plate all in there. So, you know, people say what they say. And then this so it is a black satin ribbon. It's just a big thing of black satin ribbon. It says not folded correctly. Manufacturer mistake. So I don't know how it was supposed to be folded, but they threw it away just because it was different than what it was supposed to be. So, <laughs> yeah, the things they do. Cracks me up. And this is a loom kit for making hats and stuff. It only has that smallest green one in there. Um, so I'll see if one of my aunts wants it. Uh, for making baby hats or whatever. It would be cute to figure out how to make my sister one. Uh, I somewhat know how to crochet. I'm not very good at it. Um, so I'll see if one of them wants it. And then there was three, one, two, three of these trays in there. There's a strand of lights too. I found the box and the box had something in it, but it wasn't the lights. And I didn't see the lights anywhere, so I left the box there. And what I'm thinking that piece was, was um, the actual plug-in for it. Because these are the ends of the lights. So, I guess it was, I'll have to go back and grab that piece. But I don't know why they threw these two trays away. I'm not sure. They look fine to me. This one obviously is broken, but it can be repaired super easy. Um, it just has like these little things and it just slides on and I can just glue it back in place. So that's an easy repair. I have three trays now. And then uh, these canvases were in there. Ooh, almost gave you a sneak peek at the box. <laughs> uh, they pretty much destroyed. Yes, I, I see that. But I can use the frames. Um, so I can add whatever I want and uh, use the frames to make signs and stuff. So, yeah, that's a... A pretty good haul. I would, like I said, I wasn't expecting anything. I still check that dumpster every day, even though I rarely ever find anything in there. So I was excited to find something because I used to get good scores out of there, and I haven't in months, months and months. Uh, I've actually been checking a different uh, fabric store dumpster, and that's where I found that last haul with the letters to Santa box and stuff like that. And I'm waiting to fix that joy sign still so I can hang that up. If you guys seen, um, I just have that blank frame on the wall right there. That's where I'm going to hang it. Normally I have a wreath hanging in that frame. Um, I did find that frame in the dumpster as well. So my house is a mess now. I have to clean it up. Uh, but I wanted to pop on.